Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Same location, uh, the Weasel country of Romania, but uh, different uh, city. And this is Deva. Uh, the Romanian uh, friends know exactly where that is. And uh, behind me up there, there's a long uh, um, or old uh, fortress. And that fortress uh, you can go and visit. It's a beautiful, uh, beautiful place, medieval fortress. It's a ruin, but uh, it, it's great. It's in, on top of a, of a hill over there or, or, or a mountain. So I have a little article here. Actually, this article is very funny, funny not, because um, it, it talks about the American abilities in Syria. If you remember Syria, uh, the uh, sovereign independent country of Syria um, has American um, army stationed over there illegally. And uh, even though they uh, ask for uh, Ukraine's sovereignty to be respected and independent, um, they uh, don't do the same thing in other countries. So the United States of America, you know, it has uh, at least one military bases in um, Syria and uh, against the will of the legitimate government, which is Assad's government. And um, they have about 1,000. They get the oil from there, from the northeastern part of, uh, of Syria. And um, what happened? Iran, on the other hand, was uh, invited by the legitimate government of Syria to be there, including the Russians. And uh, supposedly a drone, uh, allegedly, that's why they say allegedly, they, don't, they suspect it was a U Ukrainian, um, not Ukrainian, a... Uh, a, uh, an Iranian a drone and uh, that drone supposedly attacked a military uh, base somewhere northeast in uh, Syria. Um, the Americans retaliated obviously, shot whomever they uh, wanted because you know when you're attacked then uh, you can shoot whomever you want and uh, that's what they've been doing anyway. So now the Iranians said well we're gonna retaliate to that one which I'm guessing the Israel will be very happy about it. And I have here this uh, little article talking about the missile systems, the defense uh, missile systems the Americans have in Syria. Because that uh, military base uh, has uh, obviously uh, defensive, air defensive, um, uh, you know, missiles and all that. They didn't work. <laughs> so that drone or whatever it was uh, just slide, slid through uh, the American defenses and now they say, well, they didn't work. <laughs> Why didn't they work? Well, because, you know, they all say about the, uh, the Russians, uh, S-300, S-400, Panzer and other uh, air defense systems. Hey, they don't work, they don't work, but ours work. Okay. And now they say that those air defense systems were shut off. <laughs> I don't know exactly what the hell that is, but uh, I have here two articles or three. I think they come from the same weasels from the free mass media, which is obviously the United States of America and from uh, whomever they uh, deem um, being uh, free. So let's see these articles that I have here. Uh, they say, well, first is John Kirby. <laughs> John Kirby comes, that, was a, that was a little weasel, comes and says, well, they didn't work. Why didn't they work, buddy? So let me find this uh, article for you right here. <laughs> you can see the weasel as well. <laughs> This is uh, from the hill, right there, you see? And that's the weasel. It's like talking like, like this, like, oh, let me see, U US air defense uh, not fully um, working um, ahead of strike that killed American in Syria. American plus contractors. And contractors uh, are called mercenaries if they're Russian, and if they're Americans are just contractors, you know, but pff, whatever. So this is from the hill and it's from March 24th. And the U.S. air defense is not fully working ahead of strike that killed American in Syria. I don't think they were not working. I, I don't think they were not fully working because they were not activated. I think they were not working because they are incapable of doing that. But hey, what do I know? Let's go to the next article here, which uh, comes from Fox News. And it's uh, like this. All right, Fox News. Ram pam pam. And it says, uh, U.S. air defense down during suspected. They, they, they suspected it was the, the Iranians, but they bombarded uh, some Iranians, supposed uh, uh, locations where the Iranians are, as far as I know, I know they are legitimate being in, uh, in, uh, in Syria. Oh, are you crying, baby doll? Oh, it's a baby kid. 
So, U.S. air defense down during suspected Iranian drone strike in Syria that killed one American. The same thing. And says the main air defense system at the coalition. <laughs> they always have coalitions. Did you already notice that? The Americans are not having, not even, they're not by themselves. Always coalitions. Uh, you know, numbers uh, shows courage. And uh, military base in northeastern Syria. That's where 90%, I think, of the Syrian oil is located. And the Americans are just uh, protecting it, uh, keeping it safe for the rest of the world. So the evil Russians or who knows else, is gonna, they're going to take it. When one, America, one American contractor was killed after, killed after a suspected Iranian drone hit the base and injured six other servicemen, a senior U.S. defense official uh, said. Well, I'm sorry about this one. What, what can I say? What, what, up? what are you doing over there? You are not invited. You're, you're occupying that country, actually. But hey, what do I know? Oh, international law? Garbage. Garbage. So I use just these two uh, articles, which basically say the same thing. But um, what do you think? They were not activated or they didn't fucking work? <laughs> I don't know. They, they are the only ones uh, uh, who know. But I'm guessing that if that would have occurred uh, in Russia, they would say, see, don't buy that one. Buy ours, our uh, defense systems, because they are the best. Well, they might be. As of now, they're crying that uh, they were not activated. Well, someone needs to uh, be demoted or at least uh, court-martialed uh, because uh, I think those people who are injured over there, wounded and killed, I think they are the result, direct result of the illegal deployment of those troops in Syria, one. And the second one, uh, it's the fact that those uh, uh, defense systems were not active, activated, working, losers. Um, well, I remember when I had a conversation with my father when the Americans, um, how should I put it mildly, uh, they, um, they uh, invaded, liberated Iraq, remember? And um, we were looking like at the footage uh, provided at that time. And my father said, it seems to me like these guys are just um, using the same things like the basics in order to fight uh, the, the uh, Iraqis. They're not using the nothing particular. I said, maybe these guys are not where they say they are. Well, I paid attention and little by little, uh, it seems to me that uh, that could be the case, that they are not actually uh, having anything that they say, oh, we got, uh, how do you call those things? With laser, or laser beam, laser this, laser. I don't think they have them. If they have them, it's just, uh, uh, a pretense but hey what do I know um, so I, I guess that that's it for uh, for this article I'm sorry that those people died over there I think they were exposed to uh, uh, danger in an uh, I don't know an order is an order but then if you take it that way you would look at uh, Nuremberg trials when those bad people said well I just followed orders and that didn't qualify he said no 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 we can't accept that so you know Anyway, don't buy those uh, air defense systems. <laughs> they couldn't shoot down an Iranian drone. God damn it. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth, and be just.